So, welcome everybody, guys. We're here for HTW Midweek, and this is a special episode of Midweek Cause it's the last episode before the big event. And next Sunday, we are gonna have HTW Undesired Diamond big event. And uh, today, we are live from Jefferson City. Normally, on HTW Midweek, we have no commentary, but uh, for today, we uh, wanted to add some extra value to the production so I'm here today with commentary and uh, yeah let's see what happens uh, the first match for today on the card we are gonna have El Escavadora versus Pet Smooth event let it roll guys let it roll normally Cedric say let it roll but I'm gonna say it for today <laughs> let's go people Approaching the ring, representing Fuerza Yerba, Alex Cavadora. And approaching the ring, representing United Nations of Wrestling. Pet de Pietro's Muziv United Nations approaching the ring here in this warm night here in Jefferson City from Missouri and we are ready for our first match one on one Escavadora versus Pietro de Pietro's Muziv nice show breaker Pietro starting brutally running against the ropes oh what a close line what a counter by the Scavadora Mexican wrestler is not long that is year around in the humble talent wrestling we saw him on past week uh, he missed the beauty in a six man tag team match and uh, yeah he quite impressed me yeah. he's strong he's powerful he has for sure the right cards to be something to to fear in the future here in humble talent wrestling against the ropes another clothesline by escavadora pretty beautiful picking him up what an elbow combination great reaction by the pietro here what a chop smashing his face against the corner need to the mid section oh well pietro is going for a Mexican surfboard, but Escavadora escapes very fast from that submission attempt. Punch him on the ground, couple of stomps, elbow to the Joe. Escavadora, pretty powerful, pretty strong, and going for a torture camel clutch. We're free for this match is Mr. Brian. Against Rob's game, Pietro the Pietro, well dodged by Escavadora, what a low blow. Using dirty tricks, always. United Nations Wrestling. Back in the days, we have to remember Pietro, the Pietro Smoothie, you know. Uh, it was in the beginning of Humble Talent Wrestling, the first days of uh, this promotion. He almost have been a talent champion. He reached the finals in the first ever big tournament in Humble Talent Wrestling. And then he lost against... Marceline Rashad during the big final but yeah it's funny to think that this guy almost made history of humble talent wrestling back in the day since September 2018 the first ever big tournament ever made in this promotion big chop to the throat by the Pietro here Against the ropes, nice back switch, back switch, and look at the power of Escavadora here. Oh, what an elbow to the face, picking him up. Close line, Escavadora brutalizing the Pietro. Pietro, great reaction. Whoa, nice by Escavadora, seems pretty agile for his size. Oh, what a reaction! The Pietro can't do nothing and Escavadora again with the torture camel clutch here. Yeah. 
What a kick to the face. Oh, a Pietro. Ooh, Shining Wizard by Pietro and going for the cover. And count of one. One only. Jawbreaker. Nice. What the Pietro's gonna do? Running against the ropes. Beautiful. Ooh, what a flying uppercut. Picking him up. And a clinch. Scavadora is in the corner. Pietro running. Scavadora escapes from the corner. Uppercuts combination. The Pietro from top rope. Beautiful. Well dodge you do. I'm impressed by Escavador here. This guy is strong and agile and very aware of what happens in the ring. Picking him up. It's eight minutes already gone in the first match for tonight. He's going top rope. The Pietro no. Does not jump. Outside the ring. It's never good being outside the ring. See there, Major Giant is trying something, I don't know what. Major Giant there outside the ring, the leader of United Nations of Wrestling. Oh, what a knee to the face by Scavadora back on his feet and punishing the Pietro for this. Pietro, good reaction from the ground, a kick to the face by Scavadora seems it's not, it's not much damage from Pietro's kick. Oh, the kick to the midsection, Pietro, little bit dizzy, what a combination, devastating, but throw break says Mr. Bryant, our junior referee here in Humble Talent Wrestling, ooh, sharp special, Pietro is going top rope, can he punish him, ooh, what an elbow, to the back of Escavador, by Escavador, back on his feet, it seems that he's not damaged, this move maybe damaged more Pietro than then a Scavador right here. Oh, nice combination. Elbows by Pietro. Petrus Musiv. Also known as the Pietro. Oh, push over. It's pushing him down. Punch to the midsection. And going for the cover. Count of two. Count of three. Almost. Oh! The Major Giant is interrupting the match, or what is doing in interfering, the, what, what he wants to do? Oh my god, from top rope, the Pietro again, completely missed, Scavadora, nice muscle bomb press from the top rope. The referee is arguing with Major Giant, Scavadora from top rope again, brutal. Away from the ropes, pretty smart, but Pietro back on his feet, beautiful. Pietro flying uppercut again. He can close the match. He should go for the cover now. Against the ropes. Nice elbow. Oh, low blow. That's not completely legal. Our free started to count. But, you know, you're wrestling the rules. Before you get disqualified, our free must count to five. You know, at least here in Humble Talent Wrestling. I don't know about other promotions. Oh, nice drop kick. Very beautiful by the Pietro. Away from the ropes. He can go for the cover right now. Oh, he's picking him up. He wants to inflict some extra damage. What a brutal elbow. Working on the leg right now, the Pietro. Against the ropes. Whoa, what a kick. What a combination by the Pietro. Beautiful. Brutal kicks by the Pietro. Knee to the back of the head. Escavadora seems pretty full of energy. Pietro is doing what he can to the match. What a spear! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, guys! Oh, it's almost count of three. Beautiful. Bunch of rush by the Pietro. Knee to the face. Pietro going top rope again. What's he gonna do? Oh, beautiful DDT by the Pietro from the top rope and covering. Nice. One, two, and three. No, Escavadora survived after 50 minutes. What a brutal match are we witnessing here, people. Ooh. Reverse waterfall throw by Escavadora and covering it. Three, no. And Major Giant interfering in the match again. I don't know what he wants. He's outside the ring. Oh my god, what the Pietro is gonna do? Oh my god, it's high fly time by the Pietro here. And he must pay attention because Alchemist Alto is there. Oh, what a kick. Oh, my God. Picking him up. Going for a power bomb. No, it's not a power bomb. He's torturing him. The referee is counting because they are outside the ring. Oh, with the chair. 
Nice Frankensteiner by the Pietro. They're outside the ring. Oh my goodness. Nice belly to belly and torturing him. For free, he's still counting, you know. Almost count of 20, 16. The Pietro must go back in the ring. 18. Ooh, almost, almost count out. You know, if you reach 20, you are eliminated, you know. Brutal, brutal punches. Whoa! Power bomb, and that's it. La Escavadora and count of three. Brutal with this finisher. Escavadora win this match. It's a pretty good opening match. So a lot of nice action. Congratulations to Fuerza Yerba and uh, Escavadora. It's a great match. 95. La Bomba de Poter de Escavadora. Bomba de Poter. So the power burn from Escavadora. Yeah, great match was a great opening. Um, so uh, we are going to see on uh, on Sunday uh, at the big event, uh, Undesired Diamond. We're gonna see um, Fuerza Yerba, Alchemista Alto, and uh, Mascariana. They will go against uh, the Claudia Terror Squad for HTW Tag Team titles and um, yeah this will be on Sunday great victory by Escavadora next we are gonna have a Sensational Mercury versus Chic so let's go with the next match and here we go guys we are ready for our Match number two for tonight here at HCW Midweek live from St. Louis, Missouri and approaching the ring representing the Interplanet, the Space Warrior Sensational Mercury. And his opponent representing the Claudio Terror Squad. Silent Resentment, Chic. And here we go, the referee for this match, Mr. Gennaro Crash, legend, former FFWP wrestler and now retired, working since September 2018 as a referee in HTW, Humble Talent Wrestling. Former tag team partner of the legend Giovanni Abisso, and uh, this is brother in law. You know, Gennaro Trash is married, ma is married to the sister of Giovanni Abisso, so they are family. Okay, let's talk wrestling and let's see what happens in the second match for tonight. Interesting to see that um, the partner of uh, Sensational Mercury, Sonic Saturn. This Sunday will fight against Mikey Tourette for the HTW Twitch title, and that will be on Sunday. <sighs> Mikey Tourette, of course, also from the Claudia Terror squad. So now, let's have a little preview of uh, Interplanet versus Claudia Terror squad. Here, Sensational Mercury in blue, chic in orange and yellow began by Chic in the corner nice one two three four five brutal punches here by sensational mercury oh what an headlock very fast three minutes and ten seconds already gone in the second match for tonight elbow to the back picking him up Oh, fast, fast roll up, flashy, pin attempt, count of one only, maybe too early. But was worth a try, I guess. Back and forth, change of strikes. What kick to the midsection. Rolling it and going for the cover. Both of them, they want to try to close the match very fast. Oh, ground and pound here by Sheik. Gennaro is asking, want to give up, need to the midsection, another one, beautiful, 
soul bot against the ropes. Sunset flip. It must be. Oh my god, what? What is doing here? Is who is this guy? Oh my god. Who is this guy? Oh my god, he's attacking. Sensational Mercury. Oh my god, it's two and one now. Maybe someone else that want to be part of Claudia Terror Squad? I don't know. Maybe new member of the Claudia Terror Squad? I really don't know. I don't know what to say. This guy is here interfering in the match. Brutal punch here. Sensational Merco is trying to survive two on one referee. Gennaro Trash must take control of the situation and bam from the ring. This, this guy, I don't know. Who is this? Who is this person? I don't know. Maybe another enforcer from the Claudia Terror Squad. I don't know. Claudia has so many people on the book now. Ooh, what a close line now. Two on one, Gennaro. Must send this person away. And finally. Oh, what a brutal punch here. Shit now has a little bit of advantage after this punishment in two on one. Oh, outside the ring. What gonna happen? gonna take a little bit of breath maybe smart choice by sensational mercury here against the ropes nice funk and driver away from the ropes is gonna go for the cover no Santon. it's a smart choice oh ddt that's his finisher no that's not his i don't know oh brutal shit here german suplex and try to submit him Try to reach the ropes, Mercury. Nice, beautiful. Against the ropes, chic. Trample here. Sensational Mercury is down. Picking him up. Big end here. Oh, nice drop to hold. It's going top rope. Beautiful. At the interplanet rain. Have to go for the cover, man. 10 minutes, Gennaro is counting, count of 1, count of 2, 2 only. Into the corner. Oh, what is gonna do, maybe Spanish fly, Spanish fly time, Spanish fly! Beautiful, shooting star pin, count of 2, 3, he did it, unbelievable, great victory by Sensational Mercury here. So, now is my question, can Sonic Saturn do the same this Sunday at the HEW Undesired Diamond? Wow, fantastic, amazing. So congratulations to Sensational Mercury for this victory. And uh, yeah, let's hope that uh, his tag team partner from Interplanet, Sonic Saturn, can do the same this Sunday against Mike Tourette and maybe we're gonna have a new HTW Twitch Champion at Undesired Diamond. Okay, uh, what do we have next? Um, oh, we have uh, for the first time ever uh, the Year of the Beast Women's Tag Team Titles. They're gonna be defended in HTW. Um, Samantha Sunshine, sorry, Samantha Sunshine and BJ Madison gonna defend the Year of the Beast Women's Tag Team titles against Yuri Kono and Yuina Makimura. So let's go with the next match. So let's go guys, so we are here for our match number 3 for tonight and we have a Women's Tag Team match, ladies in action right here right now and the Year of the Beast Women's Ladies Tag Team titles are on the line. Approaching the ring here, Yuriko Ono and Yuina Makimura, the challengers. And approaching the ring uh, in their official debut in Humble Talent Wrestling, directly from Ear of the Beast. They are the Ear of the Beast uh, Ladies Tag Team Champions. BJ Madison and Samantha Sunshine. I love these girls. We're free for this match is Miss Fantasy. Let's go against the ropes. Match is starting very fast. 
Brutal Elbow by Yuina Kick, Soul Bat Kick by Samantha Sunshine. We have to say, you know, the Samantha Sunshine and BJ Madison won the last match in a Year of the Beast, and uh, yeah, now Year of the Beast is ended. Uh, they still champions. They have the belt, so. Uh, Humble Talent Wrestling decided to hire them and uh, yeah, still preserve the tradition of Year of the Beast and the tag team titles for the Year of the Beast Women's Division they will be defended in Humble Talent Wrestling from now on. Away from the ropes, Yuina Makimura picking her up, elbow to the back. Nice, very technical by Yuriko Ono. This young Japanese girl. Kick to the midsection. Beautiful. And elbow. Yuina building her momentum slowly. Poking here and there with some shooting moves. BJ Madison. But don't underestimate BJ Madison. She's a shooting queen. Also known as the MMA mama. BJ Madison. Nice combination here. By the Year of the Beast uh, Women's Tag Team Champions. Yuriko Ono in the corner going for the tag. Yuina Makimura is the new legal one in the match. Samantha Sunshine into the corner. Makimura here starting each other's. Nice brain buster. No, well dodged. Well reversed, this brainbuster attempt by Samantha Sunshine. Elbow to the back, he's down, going for the cover. Not even count of one, too early after four and a half minutes. Exchange the strikes, nice. Way from the ropes. Nice, knee to the head. Very powerful, very agile, Samantha Sanche. BJ Madison is the legal one right now. Combine it. Jump kick, low kick by Samantha Sanche. Now it's a little bit of rioting, everyone is in the ring. Remember, BJ Madison and Yuri Kono are the legal one right now. Uppercut, not connected, exchange the strikes between the two. Who is gonna be the strongest in this? BJ Madison, the brutal punch. Oh, kick by Yuriko Ono, another one. Good answer here by BJ Madison. If I have to be honest, I guess that those two girls from Year of the Beast are gonna retain the titles tonight in this match. But never say never. The young Japanese girls can do something here. Nice. What they just said. Combined brain busters by those two young Japanese girls. Oh, Yuriko Ono. Tagged in uppercut. Makimura is down. Samantha Sanchez is now the legal one. Picking her up. BJ Madison here. Reverse the Irish sweep. She stops by the ropes. Into the corner. She decide to tag Yuriko Ono one more time. Frequently tagging, frequently combined moves. So, very good chemistry by these two young Japanese girls. They are quite an experience now in Humble Talent Wrestling. Into the corner, Samantha Sunshine. She is not a joke. She is the strongest of the two, at my advice. She is much more faster much more technical than BJ Madison but BJ Madison doesn't underestimate her shooting oh beautiful when we talk about technical and speed Samantha Sunshine is the queen I'd love one day to see Samantha Sunshine competing for the Queen of Missouri title maybe it would be a dream match at my eyes seeing uh, Samantha Sunshine fighting Claudia Fast for the belt for the championship nice for the cover here, count of one only. 10 minutes already gone in this uh, third match for tonight. Miss Fantasy said give up, give up. 
attack again. Big end here. Find the Japanese girl. Oh, both of them against Rob. Superman punch. She's down. And Katajime. Katajime. She tried to reach the ropes. She escapes. Nice combination. Beautiful. Very technical. Boxing combination. To the midsection by BJ Madison. Back switch, that's not completely legal. That's not even technical. Trying to break her neck or her back, I don't know. Stretching her on the ground. Madison outside the ring now. Sunshine is the legal one, kicking down everyone. Whoa, double knee stomp from the top rope by Samantha Sunshine. Yuri Kono. It's now the legal one, kick to the midsection. Yudo throw, she is down. Picking her up, Yuri Kono, kick well dodged by Samantha Sunshine, very fast combination, beautiful. Oh, rolling the cradle, that's cradle. But she's not the legal one. Samantha Sunshine is not the legal one, so. Elbow to the back. Going for a ground and pound, ground game. Yuriko Ono, well reversed by Madison here. I don't remember BJ Madison had another iron cut, she has a new iron cut for humble talent wrestling. She is beautiful, the MMA mama here. Nice combined clothesline, you know, into the corner, reversed, and now Yon Ono into the corner. Ooh. Headlock, take down. Rob Break says Miss Fantasy. Oh no, for the tag, Makimura is the legal one right now. And now Sunshine in enemy territory, but well kicking down everyone again. Nice move by Ono. All tight working on the body or Samantha Sunshine. Free say give up, give up. Backdrop by Yuina Makimura. And going for a submission attempt. Samantha, she's not gonna give up. Tagged in. Madison is the legal one right now. Yuina Makimura kicking down everyone. She can go for the cover. No, again. Submission attempt. Good job by the referee. Miss Fantasy sent. Samantha Sunshine away, and now Madison in control for the cover. Yuriko Ono interfere and save her partner. Beautiful. Back switch. Another back switch. Elbow. Exchange strikes between uh, Madison and Makimura. Brutal punch by BJ Madison here. Tagged in. Yuriko Ono. Choking her, but it's not the legal one, just inflicting some extra damage before leaving the ring. And very fast, BJ tagging Samantha Sunshine in. That's a smart choice, frequently tagging is the key to be a good tag team. Back and forth, who's gonna win? Big end, Rico Ono, leg drop to the face of Samantha Sunshine. Need to the midsection. She's going top rope. Oh, beautiful. Wait a minute. Ooh. Knee to the back. Picking her up. Ooh, cradle. Cradle. That can be it. That can be it after 90 minutes almost. Covering. One. Two. Two only. Yudo throw. And covering. Count of one. Count of two. Ooh. Not even count of two. BJ Madison. Interrupted the count. Oh my god. Next to the ropes. Rope break. Referee. Good job, Miss Fantasy. Headlock takedown by Yuriko Ono. Makimura a little bit dizzy here. Madison is a legal one. Another Yudo throw. Beautiful one. Tagged in. And another cradle. But she's not a legal one. So making her, her a little bit dizzy, maybe, 
That can be a good idea. And oh, Katajime, Katajime. She tried to reach Rose, but Samantha Sunshine interferes and save Madison. Low kick. And now this time, whoa, beautiful. Another submission attempt against Rose. Shot special. Makimura here. Nice. Whoa. Ice Crusher. She is mad. Very sweet, you know, Makimura. I like that girl. I have to be honest. Elbow to the back. And covering. Count of one. Count of two. Two only. Going top rope. Makimura, beautiful, well dodged by Samantha Sunshine. Try to capitalize on this mistake from the young Japanese girl. And covering. Whoa. One only, but in enemy territory. So Yuriko Ono. Whoa. Covering. Count of one. Count of two. Two only. She is safe. Doesn't even need the help from BJ Madison. And now it's completely rioting. In the ring and outside the ring. Yuriko Ono kicking her, soul butt, knee to the back, and now the action is getting wild outside there, everything can happen, everything can happen, count of 14, they are back in the ring, drop kick to the back, running against the ropes, oh what a super drop kick by Samantha Sunshine, Going for the target, we remember everyone that this match is 30 minutes, so we have 6 minutes left, otherwise there will be a draw. And Sunshine and Madison retains the belt, oh my god, that can be it, that can be it. Yuriko Ono escapes, this headlock, oh my god, she's gonna go for a pile driver, Thompson pile driver, and now the only thing she has to do is covering. Why? Come on Yuriko! You should go for the cover right there. You should go for the cover right there, baby. Elbows. Elbow to the back. Sunshine. Sorry, BJ Madison. My mistake. Another elbow. Rolling up. Chop to the set. Ooh. She's brutalizing her. Oh my god. Eureka Ono. Nice suplex. And covering beautiful two three no that was very close four minutes to go they have to do better if they want to win the year of the best tag team titles year of the year of the beast woman tag team title oh figure four with bridge but rope break nice back switch oh he's blocking her beautiful beautiful Count of one, referee sent her away! Ooh, that was very close. That was very close, people. Combine his brain buster. Yuriko Ono going outside the ring, tagging her. Maybe they're gonna go for another tag move. Rushing elbow. The crowd is getting crazy. But they made a big mistake to let BJ Madison free from that corner you know now she tagging and going for a submission this is it i'm sure i'm sure yuriko is gonna give up no she reached the ropes and she escapes in the meanwhile madison blocking makimura samantha sunshine from top rope double knee stomp they're both down they're both tired and for the cover shooting star cover one two and three they retains the Bells. So they still Year of the Beast Woman's Tag Team Champions Samantha Sunshine and BJ Madison. Congratulations! So congratulations, eighty-seven percent. That is the first time that we see uh, Year of the Beast ladies tag team titles on the line here at Humble Talent Wrestling. So, one more defense for Samantha Sunshine and BJ Madison. And uh, we're ready for our main event. We're gonna have Mr. Millennium versus Terror Norris. Congratulations to the ladies.
for this great match. They defended the belt. Great debut by Samantha Sanction and B BJ Madison here in Humble Talent Wrestling midweek. So, uh, we are ready for the main event. It will be the next match. Congratulations again. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is your main event. Main event time. Approaching the ring. Representing the Hot Shotters. Accompanied by Ribbon Spotfest and Shadow Spotfest. Mr. Millennium. And approaching the ring, representing the Claudia Terror Squad, accompanied by Carson and Claudia Fest, Terror Norris. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is our main event for tonight, and here Mr. Millennium one on one versus Terror Norris. Remember, everyone, this Sunday on HTW Undesired Diamond that will be live on www.twitch.tv/slash join you by. We're gonna have a live event, big event, and uh, yeah. Claudia Terror Squad, they will go in a six man tag team match against the Hot Shotters. And uh, to be precise, it uh, will be a Tornado Elimination match. Ribbing Spotfest, Shadow Spotfest, and Mr. Millennium will fight against Terror Norris, Michelle Tourette, and Chic. It will be a six man tag team Tornado Elimination match. So now, one on one, 30 minutes, this main event, who is outside the ring? Oh, with the bat, they're not interfering. For the people that doesn't know who these people are, you know, uh, Mr. Millennium is the father of uh, Ribbing Spotfest and Shadow Spotfest. And Claudia, at the other side, the ring side, is her, his ex-wife. Maybe if someone doesn't know that, Millennium here. Nice German suplex. Need to the midsection. Beautiful move here by Terra Norris. Anaconda Vice tried to submit him after three and a half minutes. Punch to the face by Terra Norris here. Beautiful. Elbow to the back, sorry. It was a punch to the back and then an elbow to the back, pushing over an elevated Boston Crab here by Terror Norris. Nice punch, well dodged by Mr. Millennium, exchange strikes between the two. Beautiful. Picking him up, take down by Terror Norris. And again, working relentless on the neck and the arm and the elbow of Millennium. Millennium here, ooh, very fast. Going for a standing move salt. Whoa, what a backdrop! Devastating backdrop by Terror Norris. Kicking him in the diddly doodly. Where the sun goes down. Oh, Millennium is going for a pile driver here. After five and a half minutes, this match is getting brutal. Terror Norris back on his feet, so like it. Whoa. And another attempt well reversed by Terror Norris this time. Terror Norris is, is not feeling anything about this. Pow, uh, the pile driver he just received. Unbelievable. He's down. Mr. Millennium here. Elbow to the back. And a German suplex. With release. Terror Norris, great punches, great combination, and he will try again for a pile driver. But Terror Norris now is aware and try to pin him after the reversal. Elbow to the back for the cover, Mr. Millennium here, count of one only. 
those two 80 chargers against ropes nice muscle bomb press and covering two only brutal punches and mr millennium falling down and terror norris anaconda vice for the third time in this match millennium escapes Nice punchy Senua. Whoa! It's a mandible claw, brain claw, I don't know, by Millennium here. Trying to torturing Terror Norris. Millennium building his momentum here. Nice spear! But look at this. Terror Norris seems indestructible. Against the ropes. Beautiful rushing elbow. Norris back on his feet again. Back switch. And a devastating back throw. Picking him up. Into the ropes. Whoa! Exploder! Those two are showing some strength for sure around here. Running against the ropes. Muscle bump press. They are more or less the same kind of style. They are two powerhouses. Those two. Oh, DDT. The Millennium. Millennium bug. One, two. And three, no, only count of two. Into the corner. Millennium putting Terror Norris to the ropes. Oh my god, what is gonna do? Oh, power bomb into the chair. Count of one, count of two, count of three, no. That was very close. 11 minutes are gone. Iron sweep. What a kick by Terror Norris here. Bring it away from the ropes. You go for the cover. Rob break says Mr. Gennaro, very smart, Mr. Millennium. Exploder again. And covering. Count of one, count of two, count of three, no, almost. Need to the midsection. And covering again. They want to close the match. 2.9, that was very close, he's outside the ring. Terror Norris recovering a little bit of energy. Oh, Terror Norris, what is gonna do now? Brain Buster. And again, Anaconda Vice. Can Millennium survive this? Yeah, Millennium survive again. The Anaconda Vice for the fourth time in this match. And again, Millennium Bug. Going for the cover. Mr. Millennium, count of one, count of two. Count of three, no. That was very close. Again. Ho oh, Oklahoma Stampy. Going top rope. Millennium here. Sledgehammer. Devastating. Standing moonsault. Oh, but look at this. Claudia and Carson are interfering. So that maybe was a count of three. Let's change the strikes. In the ring, or three. Gennaro is distracted by the Claudia Terror Squad covering one, two, three. Uh, that was a free. Maybe Terror Norris will be not happy about this. Terror free still distracted. Spear by Mr. Millennium. And a chop. But he's tired. Millennium is tired. Ooh. Nice, beautiful combination of elbows and covering. After this, count of one, count of two, and count of three. No, Millennium survived this. Uppercut, brutal uppercut. He's down, picking him up. What a kick! Devastating kick by Terror Norris and combined it with a German suplex. But Mr. Millennium reaches the ropes. Into the ropes, trampled. By Terror Norris and Anacon device again, and he gave up. So that is a victory for Terror Norris and the Claudia Terror Squad this Sunday at the Undesired Diamond. They will fight each other in a six-man tornado elimination tag team match. So, guys, that uh, that was everything for today. This was our main event. Uh, congratulations to to Terranoris. 
great match and uh, I see everyone on uh, Sunday for uh, HTW Anxar Diamond big event. Thank you for watching and uh, I see you next time guys.